well, look at those facial expressions just from this picture. It, I'm, I'm loving this technology. It scares me a little bit with the deep fakes that are going to be happening for sure. Like 100%. Don't, don't doubt that's going to happen or already happening. I mean, we already have people in body suits and body doubles running around in politics. Anyway. I am always on the hunt for amazing AI tools. As you guys well know, I'm steeped in AI. I use it every single day. And today, I came across Emo, Emote Portrait Alive, generating expressive portrait videos with audio to video diffusion model under weak conditions. <laughs> That's what I found today. And my friends, I love it. I absolutely love this technology. Now, we can certainly look into the bad parts about this technology, but after having read this, the paper, which I'll link below, uh, this is by Lin Ryu Tian, Zi Wang, Bang Zhang, and Li Feng Bo. Emo, Emote Portrait Alive, generating expressive portrait videos with audio to video diffusion model under weak conditions. In this work, we tackled the challenge of enhancing the realism and expressiveness in talking head video generation by focusing on the dynamic and nuanced relationship between audio cues and facial mo movements. We identify the limitations of traditional techniques that often fail to capture the full spectrum of human expressions and the uniqueness of individual facial styles. To address these issues, we propose Emo, a novel framework that utilizes a direct audio to video synthesis approach, bypassing the need for intermediate 3D models or facial landmarks. And my friends, let's jump right into it. I scrolled through these briefly, and it's amazing. They can take a picture and with, with prompts, give it voice and have the picture become animated. Oh man, the world of deep fakes has just leveled up, my friends. It is amazing. Look at this. So, I'm sure I'm getting into territory of being demonetized, but man, look at this stuff. So, what? Do you see this, guys? They're taking a picture, and they are now, from this picture, abstracting an entire video and facial movements that aren't perfect just yet, but it's getting better. Man, I hope I don't get like banned or have the video deleted. Uh, certainly, it's not monetized, but man. Look at this. How? What? Things, Come on. Right? What? And, uh, maybe we have several of them, and maybe they all have different competencies. And maybe we have the general one that kind of follows us around everywhere, knows everything. Come on. About, Look at this. Uh, you know, my context, what I've been up to today. Um, what my goals are, um, sort of in life, or work, what? I'm through, and me, and so on. And you know, you can imagine that being super, super powerful. So I think it is we are right now at this inflection point of redefining what this looks like. Um, but you know, there is also. I don't know exactly <laughs> All right, I'm going to stop right there. I don't know if I actually understood. I, Dagon thing she actually said it was so ephemeral and kind of kind of ethereal in nature but again taking a picture and now being able to transpose it into a video it looks good and so here's the thing in the future you you, you might think I'll let you guys know but you might think initially that this is a video of me me but it's not it'll be just a picture or an abstraction of me uh, using my voice and communicating maybe the way I do with these expressions, who knows? And uh, it will look pretty dang real. 
So look at this. So the input speaking, singing, uh, an expressive audio driven uh, portrait video generation framework. Here's some, here's some, uh, here's some, I think there are different songs, so we'll just skip through it. But if you watch with me briefly, uh, you'll be able to see that from the reference in image and singing and talking. So cool. We'll probably skip through the singing and just go to the talking. Wow, look at those facial expressions. I think it's the most look at those facial expressions just from this picture. It, I'm I'm loving this technology. It scares me a little bit with the deep fix that are gonna be happening for sure. Like one hundred percent. Don't don't doubt that's gonna happen or already happening. I mean, we already have people in body suits and body doubles running around in politics. Anyway. Help. Let's see what else. Uh, this is more bit oof okay Oh man. Wait, what? I just, I get it. I get it. Like different, different intonations, different inflections, different facial movements for different language types. I get it. Wow. It's so cool. I'm just scrubbing through this as I go through and you can see. See, they just take these image. How they they make her whole body move. It's awesome. This is really cool technology, my friends. Let's keep scrubbing through this. Maybe they'll get back to some more talking. Oh, he's like rapping. This is what Leon Leonardo DiCaprio rapping Eminem style. What's this guy doing? Oh, we've already shown that one. Let's scroll through one of these. Oh, okay. There's no shame in that. There's no shame in how you're feeling, and also you don't need to. Oh. Ooh! Wow. Oh, here we go. That's right. Why so serious? Why so serious? <laughs> Oh, come on. He looks plastic already in the reference image, man. All that makeup. Wow. Okay, well, really amazing tech. Obviously, they talk about the methods, how they do it. Uh, I guess here's more, uh, more make portraits sing, different languages. I guess this is the different examples that we could have scrolled through. It's just, it's amazing. I'll leave the link below for you guys to check this out. But I'll tell you, my friends, this, this is, this is going, being on the bleeding edge of technology, getting in inbound news every single day. It's part of my schedule. You guys know I'm constantly reading so much and just ingesting so much data around Web3, blockchain, Bitcoin, crypto, AI, man. The future is going to be amazing. Maybe just amazingly scary. But I love I love checking out this technology. I hope you guys enjoy enjoy it when I share some of the stuff that just shocks me and excites me. Uh, who knows where it's going to be going, whether it's going to be used for good or for bad. I think it's easy for us to focus on the bad. But th I think the the right operators, the right entrepreneurs will look at these, this technology, as an opportunity to say, how can I create something that's new and novel, never been done before? Man, I, I'm going to tell you, we're, it's not going to be long until we see the first fully AI-generated movie. Oh, it's coming, guys. Oh, it's coming. It's all coming. It's all coming. See you.